Epic Studios Tattoo collaborated with UWSP printmaking classes to put on an art gallery called Epic Exhibit. Um, so we have a gallery space here, and uh, my, um, my, my wife is an art student and had a pretty good rapport with some of the professors and had talked back and forth with them about doing some shows here once we got up and running. So this is the first one that was available. And uh, Professor Erickson pointed out uh, a couple of different ways that printmaking is real similar to tattoo design, um, some of the similarities. and. Um, it just seemed like a good way to kind of kick it open and showcase some of the students that are nearby and get a little exposure for them and a little bit for us. Neil says one of the most rewarding experiences was being able to work with students and different art forms. Um, it's kind of neat. I, I hadn't really entertained the idea of uh, other media, other art forms being um, similar to what we do here. Um, and it was kind of neat talking with the other artists and seeing what they liked and didn't like about the project and what was a little more challenging and stuff. One objective Neil has is to change people's perception. Kind of trying to change perceptions about tattoo studios a little bit, that it's not, you know, that it's an actual art form too, not just making tattoos that, you know, some of us actually draw and paint and stuff too. Not only is Neil excited about the collaborations, so are the printmaking students. Uh, I'm actually uh, double majoring as a uh, 2D artist and the graphic design. I'm kind of more working on 2D right now though, rather than graphic design. And I could have graduated actually my fifth year, and I had the, de the decision between graduating and then taking printmaking. I took printmaking and I'm really happy I did because I really enjoy it. So. My major is, I'm a Bachelor of Arts with um, an Asian art history now. Got into printmaking I, because I, I want to work with photography. Um, it's like my main passion. And being able to take uh, the photography aspect and developing it into um, a print or being able to print my photography through printmaking, I, um, I fell in love with it. It's, it's a really awesome process. The students are very enthusiastic about their artwork being displayed. It's, it's awesome. I, I mean, you know, I'm always looking for opportunities to get, you know, my name out there, get my artwork out there, and to be seen. And someone actually bought one of mine and is getting it as a tattoo on their, like, leg. So, I mean, it's nice to get, like, the art exposure and just to have, like, uh, people look at our art. It's really nice. This event benefits both Epic Studios and printmaking students alike. Well, I think... For like the art students or and UWSP in general, we're always looking for places to like have our art be seen outside of like campus. And then it also I don't know, if people see our art, they'll probably be more apt to come to like events with our art at it. And then um, Epic Studios, if they have people from campus going in to their studio, there it'll bring in business to them. And I don't know, it's just a nice, a nice little synergy there. You know, the students get to have their artwork shown, and that in return, you know, it brings students to the place where it's being shown, and, um, you know, gives them business, and luckily we were able to be there on their, like, grand opening day, which is a, it's a pretty big deal for them, too. For more campus, national, and world news, stay tuned to The Pointer at pointeronline.uwsp.edu.